Uh, my name is Sultan Adeniji Adele. I'm from Lagos State. I stay in Festac Town. I'm vying for the Lagos State House of Assembly. Well, it's um, the call of my people. I once served as a member of the Lagos State House of Assembly. And then from 2011 to 2015, and we did numerous activities in terms of um, infrastructure, in terms of uh, personal responsibilities, and they urge for my people to return to the house. We have, we have also been clamoring for the a principal office in Amuod of Ilokagome in terms of appointment, in terms of um, election, in terms of uh, selection. Amuod of local government has always been shortchanged in terms of. Um, the hierarchy at the state level and it's a plus for us if going back to the assembly as a ranking member definitely i am going to be either a um, ranking member of the house of assembly a principal officer of the house of assembly or we head or chair a very very lucrative committee that will make my people smile it's a common cause, it's a cause of the people of Amu of local government. Check out the history of Amu of local government. We've not had basically a commissioner here. We've not had basically a ranking member of the state government at the ESCO level or either at the legislative level. So myself returning to the House of Assembly will give us a chance. One of either becoming the deputy speaker or secondly will give us a ranking position in the House of Assembly. Then we will know that Amu Odofi is in the higher ranks in the state within the state. So I think it's a very good reason for me to return back to the House of Assembly. One, to continue serving my people, then two, to get what we have been clamoring for in Amu of in local government. Um, well, I've been addressing one when I was in the House of Assembly, which is um, the Wealth Creation Bill. It's something I studied and I noticed. First start town, Amu Wadofim, Maltu, um, Abuladu. You notice we have lots of youths within them. And um, most of these youths are idle presently due to the economic situation of the country in terms you know the apc government just took over from the pdp after six, 16 years of um, mismanagement so the apc is trying to put things together and i looked at it i saw that well the majority of the constituents are youth the wealth creation bill is a bill like introduced into the house in 2012 it was on the second reading before it was stepped down for some reasons. And today, that world creation has a ministry of its own. You know, we have a world creation ministry today. I was the one who championed, who pioneered that bill on the floor of the House of Assembly. Two, in terms of um, drainage, it's been a major problem in Amu of Iloka, especially the Baitul area, where we are. Whenever it rains, people cannot go out of the house. People are lockdown in the houses and then um, it's an issue we looked at while i was in office in 2011 to 2015 we brought some engineers from the lagos state uh, public works they came there to look to look at the extent of um, renovation done with the residents of the area and then um, it was something we were embarking on before what happened before this happened but um, it's something we are going to look at vigorously when we return into the House of Assembly. Then three, thirdly, you know the House of Assembly is basically a legislative affair. We, my major aim, my major purpose of being a member of the House of Assembly is to make laws that will benefit the constituents of a move of a local government. So we'll keep on working with interest groups, we'll keep on working with um, stakeholders within the community will keep on working with the resident association with the cds and cdc's to know actually what and how we can make laws to benefit the people of a mode of a constituency one